from Tampa Bay's streaming news leader. Brought to you by AlertTodayFlorida.com. This is ABC Action News. Hello everyone, I'm Paul Legrone. Jason Adams has Florida's most accurate forecast in just a moment, but first here are your ABC Action News Now headlines. Hillsborough County Fire Rescue battling a large fire in Northdale. Firefighters grew concerned after neighbors told them they thought there was live ammunition inside that home. Officials still working on finding the cause. A winter storm brings feet of snow to Virginia and North Carolina, and tonight the death toll is rising. So far, three people have lost their life to the storm. Right now, it's finally moving offshore, ending days of snow and freezing rain across that region. Airlines canceling more than 1,000 flights across the country due to that storm, including multiple flights at Tampa International. Zoo Tampa at Lowry Park now says it plans to keep its head veterinarian on board but he will not be allowed to treat manatees anymore. The zoo says an outside panel found that Dr. Ray Ball did not cause the death of any manatees. That investigation began after allegations came to light that Dr. Ball performed improper manatee medical treatment. A Polk City man is arrested after deputies say he confessed to recording people at an employee bathroom at Disney World. 21 year old Eric King allegedly took the video using his phone. Disney is now placing him on leave as deputies move forward with video voyeurism charges. Here's Jason with your forecast. Tuesday morning will start out chilly. Temperatures into the low to mid 40s for most of us. Perhaps a few upper 30s showing up here north of Hernando County. Not expecting a frost or freeze concern. And what you will notice as we go through the day, though, is more sunshine builds and especially as we get into the afternoon hours. But look at temperatures, even with sunny skies, mainly in the 50s throughout the day. A few low 60s from I-4 South. But these temperatures are a good 10 to almost 15 degrees below average. And it only gets colder from here when you wake up Wednesday morning. Widespread 30s for inland spots, 40s for the beaches. But we could see some frost concerns from Citrus, Hernando and Pasco County areas also into Sumter County as we get into your Wednesday morning. And don't forget you can get your news updates all day long and your favorite streaming device and remember to download our free ABC Action News app. This ABC Action News Brief was brought to you by AlertTodayFlorida.com. Bicyclists always wear a helmet and ride in the same direction of traffic on the street because safety doesn't happen by accident.